golf for me wasn't always the biggest sport or the, the main deal when I was growing up, but I had, I had a grandparent, uh, actually my dad's dad, that really enjoyed the game. And it was kind of those first times going out with him that I really came to appreciate golf, maybe not from a competitive aspect, but more of just an overall appreciation of the game and, and what it stands for. I would say Daniel is someone who, um, he's a serious person, but yet he's a fun person. He enjoys being with his friends. He enjoys all the things that, you know, young kids enjoy doing as they're growing up, but he has a serious side to him as well. And, uh, you know, we've come to really appreciate that. He seems to excel in every field that he gets involved in. And he has like a passion for everything that he tries. And um, his music is just one facet of his personality that reflects his, what he's all about. He's extremely disciplined, but he's also very multifaceted. Uh, so many of the juniors that uh, we see these days, I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing, but they seem to focus entirely on golf year round, and that's the only thing they do. Uh, Daniel seems to have a multitude of interests. He leads by example, and the way he carries himself just draws that attention to him you know, from his teammates, from his classmates. You really wouldn't know whether it was the academics or golf. They're true friends. Daniel uh, became a leader of the team, not by any edict, not by any statement of mine. When we didn't accomplish an objective, Daniel would be the first one to say, Coach, uh, what do we have to do to, uh, to do better next time? You know, he was always always inquisitive, always building, always uh, looking forward as to what we had to do. You know, our family has always stressed the importance of trying to help others, you know, whenever you can. We feel really, really lucky, and Daniel is very lucky because he's a healthy person. He's got a good head on his shoulders, and so, you know, I think he felt it to be important to try to help others. I introduced Daniel through Leadership Links by his word of mouth. Um, he thought that was really cool and wanted to do the same. He decided to get involved with Leadership Links, and at that time, he had to decide what the charity of choice would be. And I think that got him thinking about what charity would be really important to him. Life Act is a nonprofit organization that's based out of Northeast Ohio. We go into middle school and high schools, and we teach suicide prevention and depression awareness. We have a couple of family members that have uh, have struggled with, with this issue over the past couple of years, um, specifically my cousin Anna. And Anna has, has overcome many of these obstacles in her life and that's something that constantly impresses me and constantly motivates me to keep on fundraising money, whether it's through leadership links or um, any other method. Daniel's been with us on the Youth Advisory Board for the past three years, but this past year he's been our president and as he uh, assumed the responsibility of the president, he's grown as a leader and he has, has put a thumbprint on everything that he has done in the last year. I think any child who decides to become involved, um, if their heart is in it, um, it's a whole different experience. And, you know, Daniel knew this was a need um, from personal experience. Um, with our family members, and um, that was enough. I've talked to Danny, you know, briefly about what are you going to do when you graduate, and um, I think he's, I don't think he's totally committed, but I think whatever he does choose, I'm sure he's going to be successful because of the qualities that he has. He's one of those, one of those people, and extraordinarily so, I think, because he's so young, that whenever I'm around Daniel, I start thinking about, no, wait a minute, what is it that I've been doing? What's exciting for me as a parent, as a coach, is where does this trajectory go? You know, this, is, this is not even out of high school yet, where does this go?